G'day guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, as you can see, I've got my ramp here and uh, freshly painted it. And um, I just wanted to add some grip to this ramp because especially winter coming up in the next few months, um, if I take this with me down to the field or whatever, you know, the, I'll be probably running it in the wet. And, um, you know, obviously when you're running on the wet, the tires are gonna get wet. And once it approaches the ramp, you've got a high risk of it slipping over to the side. So um, I've decided to go down the local hardware store and buy some of this uh, croc grip tape. Now this is designed for, um, steps as you can see here so it's an anti-slip tape i bought a couple of uh, rolls here it's commercial high grit i believe it's 60 grit this particular roll and um, i'm gonna just uh lay a few strips uh, all along the ramp and uh, add some grip to it so um i initially did look at on ebay for you know the skateboard deck um grip tape for skateboards and that was rather expensive actually um, online it ranged from about 14 bucks per sheet just to do one skateboard so so being that this ramp is um, a little over half a meter wide it's actually 60 centimeters wide by 80 centimeters in length from top to bottom um, yeah it would have been really expensive to buy uh, skateboard uh, grip tape and it wouldn't have reached to the top either so I've got, um, as you can see, five meters length by 48. So I'll just lay a few strips up here. I'll start from one side, then work my way in. If there is a bit in the middle left over, I'm not really worried about that. So, uh, all right, I'll uh, show you guys once it's done. Oh, by the way, this stuff per roll is only 11 bucks at Bunnings. So anyone living in Australia or New Zealand, uh, yeah, you can get this at Bunnings. Okay, so I'm gonna get into it guys and I'll show you the, the finished product. So here's the tape here guys, I'm just taking out the packaging and as you can see, it's fairly decent grit, 60 grit. It's got the backing on the side. So it's basically gonna put, lay some strips down there like that and uh, cut it to size. So I'll get into that now. What I've gone ahead and done is I've pre-cut the links um, from that roll. Now I've gone through one roll already as you can see. Uh, so I've got half a dozen strips exactly the height of the ramp here and there was that much left over from the roll guys after cutting those out. So I've got another roll as you can see. So I'm going to get about a dozen strips out of uh, this particular ramp. Alright guys, well I'm all done. There it is. Um, I had enough to do the whole ramp out of those two rolls. There's just a center stripe there is where I ran out. So I just done uh, half a dozen on this side, half a dozen on that side, and only cost 11 bucks a roll. So uh, that little uh, line in the middle, you know, it's just like a guide, a center guide now. So yeah, pretty good stuff. Um, it's gonna make this ramp a lot more durable as far as uh, damage is concerned. Like uh, when I last took the ramp out with the Bowie truck, you know, it, it gouged out a big chunk out of this side here. So this is gonna protect it from damage and it's gonna be waterproof as well. I won't have to paint the ramp um, as often, you know, to stop it from rotting uh, once it's it gets wet. So yeah, pretty happy the way it turned out, guys. Uh, it's, pretty grippy too so once the trucks uh, hit the ramp it's gonna grip rather than slide around especially in winter so yeah let me know what you think guys uh, I think it turned out pretty cool I'm happy with it anyway for $11 a roll I just needed two rolls so as <clears throat> if you're in um, Australia New Zealand uh, if you got a, you know homemade ramp like this you might want to pick up some of this stuff it's called croc grip grit that bites and uh, this is the rolls that I use five meter roll by 48 millimeter wide and um, if you've got a similar size ramp to mine that's uh, that's as much as you're gonna material you're gonna need enough to do the whole ramp so yeah pretty happy with it guys it's the commercial high grit stuff so 11 bucks a roll 
bargain I reckon I only had to spend $22 that's in Australian dollars of course so yeah pretty happy with it so um, yeah like I said it should be more durable now it should be um, you know it shouldn't uh, take on as much damage as what it did before being uh, bare ply um, like when I took it out last time and I'm not gonna have to paint it so often like you know I've painted the actual ramp a couple of times because the paint does wear out I've had this ramp for a couple of years now and to stop it from rotting you have to refresh the paint you know give it another lick of paint a couple of coats so I won't have to do the actual ramp itself so anyway guys thanks for watching just thought I'll um, make a quick video of what I've done to this one I had plans to do it just after I painted it so I thought I'll um, yeah, show you guys the product I used and how cheap it is to actually add some good grip to your ramp for your RC trucks so when you go bashing so thanks very much for watching if you're new to the channel feel free to subscribe like comment all that good stuff and uh, stay tuned thanks for watching I'll catch you on the next one till then enjoy the hobby bye for now